Mark Bradke. Oh, sensational stuff, Mark Bradke. Mark Bradke's continuing climb up basketball's most valuable list is paralleled by the flourishing tennis success of Nicole Provis. The pair hit it off at the 92 Olympic Games in Barcelona, and with lifestyle and career paths that seemed so similar, no one was that surprised to hear word of a wedding. On the Melbourne summer's day, the pair decided to tie the knot. All the famous faces of basketball and tennis turned out. Tigers Steve Whitehead and Nick Tenner were there, so were Lennard and girlfriend Dave Simmons, assistant coach Alan Westover. But as for the coach, Lindsay Gaze, well, he'll be along any time. Neil Fraser led the tennis brigade, supported by Todd Woodbridge, Paul McNamee, even Pam Shriver had jetted in from the US for the big occasion. But still, no sign of Lindsay Gaze. The four groomsmen, Robert Sibley, Andrew Gaze, Andrew Vlahoff and Warwick Giddy, made sure their man was there ahead of schedule and ready. How you feeling, mate? Fine. You ready? Yeah. Our hubby-to-be and the crowd of well-wishers didn't have to wait more than a few minutes past the hour for the arrival of the elegant bridal party. Okay, yeah, okay. Fine, yeah. <laughs> Inside, the service was going ahead without a hitch until a late arrival tried to sneak through undetected. Last in, first out. That was a ceremony, Lynn. I breathe for me. <laughs> there were plenty desperate to catch a snap of Australia's newest sporting couple. Lindsay wasn't missing out. He photographed the photographers. It was tough on the big fellow. I thought he was going to go there for a while, but the young tough. And while the happy couple made their way to a glittering reception at the Australia Club, the experts pondered whether marriage would alter the career paths of Mr and Mrs Bradkey. When she went to England at that time, it was just crazy. There were football teams chasing her and things like that. So, I mean, I think Mark should be checking out what happened back in the UK. So he's beat some pretty stiff competition. Ab absolutely. I mean, and they haven't called it the glam queen for nothing, you know. And who will be the next Tiger to leave the pack and take a walk down the aisle? And then there will be... Uh, who's left? Uh, <laughs> I'm left. Uh, it's a, it'll be a while before I get married, I think. You sure? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Another couple of years, I think. You know, there's some rumours. Rumours about what? About you getting married? Don't say I'm too loud, yo. No, no, I'm just... Another couple of years, I think. <laughs> I'm telling you that.